but I was a huge fan of film scoring before I actually was doing it myself. When kids had pictures of the Beastie Boys and Metallica and you know all these other popular bands that were around, I had pictures of John Williams and Jerry Goldsmith and you know the list goes on and on. When I was coming up in this business, I did start off doing a lot of um, directed DVD work for the studios and I feel like that's where I learned a lot of the stuff um, that I apply today on the bigger projects. There's never just one person that makes every single creative decision. It always seems like it's a um, full-on collaboration. And I think that's the thing with film scoring. I mean, film scoring is one of the most collaborative mediums out there when it comes to music. I haven't told you everything. The city is ground zero in a war it doesn't even know is happening. <laughs> Daredevil is a, is a very, very tricky series. We really wanted to do something different than what's already been done. So I think one of the challenges of Daredevil was how do we do the superhero energy and the superhero vibe, but at the same time too, make it feel really grounded. get to a certain level in this business and everyone is very, very talented. Everybody is a great composer. So one of the greatest pieces of advice that was given to me, and, I, and I'll pay, pay it forward, is, is really challenge yourself to always keep up with the latest and the greatest technologies, whether it's OS's, whether it's DAW's, whether it's uh, plugins, all the different things. I mean, it's, it's really important to always keep on top of that stuff. Pro Tools is the center of our universe. Everything does end up in Pro Tools. You know, we work on a couple different types of projects in the studio. We work on video games, we work on feature films, and we work on television. Um, and Pro Tools serves different capacities in each one of those. With television, everything from the writing process, from MIDI mock-ups, orchestral mock-ups, through uh, to the mixing process. With feature films, it starts with MIDI mock-ups into Sibelius for orchestration and prep work, and then from the orchestration and prep work into Pro Tools for, for final mix and delivery. That's why it's so important that Avid is a huge part of our workflow. I, a couple years ago, we used to use a different system where we were using another DAW and then we were feeding it through Pro Tools and then as time's gone on and as Pro Tools has progressed and progressed, it's become more part of our, our system. Pro Tools, Sibelius, and all the other products that we use, even though they're extremely complex pieces of software and complex pieces of hardware, the ease at which you work them allows us to think creatively first. And I believe without that, it would be extremely difficult to be as creative as you can be from a writing standpoint, from a DAW standpoint, from a recording standpoint. Um, it's a huge part of our workflow now.